Hey, hey, what's happening, everybody? So, last week I was watching a video on one of my favorite YouTube channels, uh, Prim's Hood Cinema. Definitely check that one out. And he was talking about the final episode of Moesha and really how weird and bad the final season of Moesha turned out. And so it got me kind of thinking about what is the worst final season of a show that you used to love? Like you kind of rewatch it and then you go back to it and then you get to that last season. It's just like, damn, got to watch this shit again. Like obviously the big one of recent times was Game of Thrones. Uh, a lot of y'all was heated at Game of Thrones this final season. We're just not pleased with it. And so that's definitely one with how with how the storylines played out. Uh, Sons of Anarchy, that's another big one where people are just like, God damn, these last couple seasons is just not, not fun at all. Um, I'll nominate something from my childhood, uh, X-Men the Animated Series. I think I have to go back and rewatch that because I don't remember the last season necessarily being bad. I remember the art style change and that kind of threw things off for me and I really wasn't feeling the new direction that they went with how the characters looked and so I kind of was off that way. By the time that that came out, it was, it was, it was a wrap and so I got to rewatch it but that one is for sure. That one's one that's on my mind heavy. Um, yeah, Moesha season five, and really, Moesha, once the Dorian is Frank's child revealed happened, yeah, the show, like, the show was just put on Death's Door. Like, the show, they weren't dead, but they were definitely had one foot in the grave once that happened because it was not a good decision. Kind of threw the show off, and honestly, the Ray J character, Dorian D. Money, was not a good addition to Moesha. Honestly, we can say this about another addition that happened with Ray J., when he got added to one on one, when one on one, when they went from Baltimore to California, when uh, Arnez and when Brianna went from living in Baltimore to being in L.A., show was never the same. Spirit was gone. Flex wasn't around like Dwayne wasn't around. And so that really that threw a lot of stuff off. The energy was just not right. And. Look, Ray J wasn't the worst thing about that final season, but just in general, the last season of one on one is just not not very good and it's a problem that happens with a lot of black shows is that because black shows end up getting canceled in like the last season or like randomly we never get like proper conclusions and so it ends on a sour note and the creators don't get a chance to kind of do a make good kind of real big finale type season but yeah, Moesha season five was just weird. Like, it ended on a who's pregnant cliffhanger. Like, do y'all remember that the random white girl that was just added to Moesha's crew? It was Moesha, Nisi, um, Kim Fields, younger sister, and uh, of course, Hakeem was still around, and Lorenz Tate's brother was on there. He was actually a funny addition. Like, he was studying to be a clown. He was actually a fun addition. He was thirsty as hell for Nisi, but... Yeah, it was it was a weird season. And of course, it ends with someone's pregnant and Miles has been kidnapped. So that's definitely one where I think, you know, if they had another shot and especially if they were able to work things out, they probably could have did something a little bit better for that final season of Moesha. But I kind of want to hear from you guys, like what, in your opinion, is the worst final season of a show that you once loved, that you once enjoyed like hell? One that you couldn't wait to see, and then when that final season came around, like pretty much from episode one, ooh, energy wasn't right. Like The Wire, I think is kind of in that boat. Like it's a bad season of The Wire, but it's still The Wire, so it's still great television. And so that one's that one's debatable. Like it's it's bad compared to the rest of the show, but as a show, and like if this was like a season of any other show, it'd be hailed as one of the best. But yeah. Want to hear from uh, anybody out there, so leave a comment. Let me know what's the worst final season of a show that you once loved. And if you like this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram, Jamel727. Uh, make sure you go over to YouTube and subscribe to my YouTube channel at Eastside. Uh, I'm on Eastside Reviews over there. I do movie, TV, wrestling reviews. You know, it's a pretty good time. And make sure you follow the homie uh, History Williams over at twitch.tv slash history with two S's W because every Thursday, myself, 
history and the homie JT the voice. We do our historical voices from the East Side podcast. We go over movies. We talk about things going on in culture. Like we we have a good time. We have we have fun. We we have fun around there. So yeah. East Side Reviews on YouTube, Twitch, History W, and of course here on Instagram at Jamel727. Take care of yourself. Make sure you're drinking plenty of water. Try and stay cool because it's hot as hell, especially here in Phoenix. Catch you next time for something else. Peace.